the Italian beat Sam Bennett to victory in a fast and frantic transition stage at the Giro d'Italia. Ilia Viviani, quick step floors, took his fourth stage victory of the 2018 Giro d'Italia, sprinting ahead of Sam Bennett, Bora Hans Grohe, to the finish in a CO on stage 17. The Italian was able to benefit from a late lead-out by two teammates, and was dropped off perfectly within the last 100 meters for him sprint from the front of the pack towards the line as the rain fell heavily at the finish. Bennett, who clearly had the speed for victory, found himself quite far back and was forced to move wide on the right of the road as Niccolo Bonifazio, Bahrain Merida, began his sprint. The Irishman was able to get close to Viviani, but just ran out of road as they approached the line. The win for Viviani effectively wraps up the Maglia Cyclamino points classification, with three tough mountain stages to come and a final sprint in Rome on Sunday. Simon Yates, Mitchelton Scott, was able to come home safely on the 17th day of racing at the Gyro, maintaining his lead in the Maglia Rosa by 56 seconds over second overall Tom Dumoulin, Sunweb. There were no changes in the top 10 overall at the end of the stage. How it happened after stage 16's time trial, the peloton faced a relatively short 155 km stage from Riva del Garda to Asio, with nearly all of the climbing coming in the first half of the race before a flat final section. That meant a lot of riders were interested in getting in a breakaway over the early climbs and putting in a significant gap into the peloton behind in hope of victory. With the mountains looming on the coming stages, there was a huge fight to make the break, with constant attacking from a whole host of riders with Mitchelton Scott and Bora Hans Grohe the main teams closing gaps to those out front. With around 85 kilometers to go a group finally formed, but were restricted to just a maximum gap of 25 seconds on the bunch thanks in part to the presence of Sky Swoot Pools, who sat at around 10 minutes down on the overall. He was joined by his teammate Caniela Sand, Luis Leon Sanchez, Astana, Giovanni Visconti, Bahrain Merida, Ben Hermans, Israel Cycling Academy, Alessandro De Marchi, BMC, Alexander Geniz, Arc 2 Arla Mundial, and Max Schachmann. Quick step, but it never looked promising. They were eventually dragged back with around 66 kilometers to go, but Pools was not keen on letting the break fade away. Demarkey likewise wanted a group to stay away and attacked with 64 kilometers to go, taking Sanchez, Pools and Hermans with him. The peloton eventually relented in its pursuit of the group of four, allowing a gap of almost 1 to 30 to grow out, safe in the knowledge they could bring them back on the flat run to the finish and set things up for a sprint to the line. The four out front rode well together, but as they reached the finishing circuit in ISEA, the gap was tenuous at just 40 seconds or so. Pools was the first to give up and go back to the bunch with 21 kilometers to go, before Hermans had to relent with the fierce pace that Sanchez and Demarkey were holding out front. That pair were able to maintain 22 seconds on the peloton as Lawton Aljumbo and Bora marshaled the front, allowing the breakers to ride with a small gap before bringing it all back together with 11.7 kilometers to go to set up a sprint. With that catch coming quite early, it opened up the possibility of attacks with John Luca Brambilla, Trek Segafredo, going for it with 9 kilometers to go with Robert Gessing, Lawton Aljumbo, and Cesare Benedetti, Bora Hans Groe chasing. The latter pair refused to work with Bram Billa with the respective sprinter and Danny Van Poppel and Sam Bennett back in the bunch with Zdenek Stybar, Quick Step and Sergio Haynau, Team Sky, bridging across before they were quickly caught by the bunch. With 5 kilometers to go and Mitchelton Scott on the front protecting race leader Yates, Mauritz Lammerding, Katusha Alperson, was the next to have an attack and was able to gain 7 seconds on the peloton. The Dutchman's efforts were in vain though, and was brought back with 3 kilometers to go. Lotten Jumbo led into the final kilometer, but Quick Step were able to reorganize to put Viviani to the front as the peloton approached the line. 
from there he was able to launch his sprint clear out front, and take a fifth career stage win at the gyro and set up victory in the points classification. Stage 18 of the gyro will see the GC fight come back to the fore with 196 kilometers from Abiat Grasso to Prado Nevoso with a Category 1 summit finish. One Elia Viviani, Ida, Quick Step Floors, in 3, 1, 9, 5, 7, 2 Sam Bennett, IRL, Bora Hans Groe, 3 Niccolo Bonifacio, Ida, Bahrain Marita, 4 Danny Van Poppel, Ned, Lottenel Jumbo, 5 Jens de Buscher, Bell, Lotto Sotel, 6 Christian Sibirali, Ida, Israel Cycling Academy, 7 Jean Pierre Drucker, Lux BMC Racing Teammate, Sasha Matolo, Ida, EF Education First Repack, 9 Andrea Vendrine, Ida, Androni Jokatelis, Idermic, 10 Jose Goncolves, 4 Katusha Alpeson, all same time overall classification after stage 17 won Simon Yates, GBR, Mitchelton Scott, in 6959112 2 Tom Dumoulin, Ned, Team Sun Web, at 56 is 3 Domenico Pazavivo, Ida, Bahrain Marita, at 3, 1, 1, 4 Chris Frome, GBR, Team Sky, at 3, 5, 0, 5 T Bopino, Fra, Groupama FDJ, at 4, 1, 9, 6 Rohan Dennis, Aus, BMC Racing Team, at 5, 0, 4, 7 Miguel Angel Lopez, Call, Astana Pro Team, at 5, 3, 7, 8 Palo Bilbao, especially, Astana Pro Team, at 6, 0, 2, 9 Richard Carapaz, AQ, Movie Star Team, at 6, 07, 10 George Bennett, NZL, Lottenel Jumbo, at 7, 01.